so guys i want to show you how to play oh no i hope i don't fall um a previous video i actually played it on the acoustic guitar but this time i want the i'm gonna play the exact same thing on the electric guitar and this video specialty is i'm gonna try to make it as easy as possible i'm gonna take it very slow i'll just show you everything from the zeros so let's just start it if you have acoustic electric really doesn't matter we understand chaining so have a look at the tab uh we actually started with the a minor chord we have an a minor chord which sounds like this so now what i'm doing i'm having b string first fret with the index finger so my index on b1 my ring and my middle together on the second fret of the d as well as on the g string i got open a open high e and i'll try it from from the a string from a couple of times now have a look at the tab we do one dance shook on the open a as well as on the second fret of the d string you can see it's a small strum so we are strumming the a as well as the d string together we're gonna get the sound and then you just have that a minor chord you don't have to move around just hold that a minor chord you strum the a and d now you hit the b string and the g string so we got and if you talk about the motion i'm actually going down up down which means on the first stroke i'm going down then i'm doing a up stroke on the b then a down stroke on the g now most people will tell you to go down 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 but that's actually not how you're going to play a guitar if you go for alternate shading that's going to help you to play things fastly uh gonna help you in every every single stuff so make sure you follow down up down up down up down up not down down not even down down up it should be down up down so we got down up down see that nice and easy and now i have the a minor chord what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna do a hammer on from one to three on the b string and my pinky is helping me in that case and then i pull off Like this. So you're gonna be quick. So you got. Now I play second fret on the G string, which is there in the chord shape. And now I just remove my ring finger from the second fret of the G string to make it a uh, open. And I do a down stroke. The previous stroke was a uh, up, so it has to be a down this time. So you got. down down up up down one more time up down down up down and now what we're going to do is we're just going to have our middle finger on second fret of the d string and we're going to play we're going to play d g d down up down you see that nice and easy And then we have. I'm actually doing a hammer on to a pull up on the second fret of the G string. So we got. And this is actually an up stroke. So nice and easy. Take your time. Play it very slow. So we got. And now just gonna hit second fret on the D string. And you're gonna just wait there for uh, like a two second. So we got the or the A minor was like this. And now we are into a C major chord, where we have a ring finger on the third fret of the A, and we have a middle finger on the second fret of the D. We're gonna play A D A, which is down up down. See that? Pretty easy. I think easiest. down up down and now i'm going to bring this exact shape over here on this dot you see so it's now 5 on the a 4 on the d it's now a c c sharp a d major that was a c now it's a d i'm going to exact same pattern a d a so we got down up down 
and now we are into a major chord and uh, they're gonna be small transition from a major to a a7 so see what i'm doing i'm having my index finger so this is my index finger i'm barring that on the whole second fret of the d g b uh, you don't need the high e string for this song so don't need to bother about that but you're barring the d g b and make sure you get that open e string we are playing a we are playing a g a down up down so it's open second open a g a and then we have a pull off so we got that bar and now we're going to do a hammer on to a pull off from second four to second on the g string see that again this has to be quick and then i play So I actually do a downstroke on the G string 2nd fret and then I just remove my index and put that on the B string 1st fret, I'm sorry, B string 2nd fret and now I also have open G and I'm gonna only strum that G and the B string with the pick. So it's now a A7, so major to a major 7, um, to a dominant 7. So we got the A minor. C. D, A major, A7, now I'm actually doing a slide from C major to a D, see that, A, D, A slide, you can do that and that was basically it i tried to make it as easy as possible and for the last time i just want to play it at super slow speed for you guys And that's pretty much the whole song. Uh, if this video helps you out, uh, make sure to drop me uh, one of these. If you haven't subscribed, make sure to do so. And uh, that's basically everything. Bye. I can't make this video any bit longer because uh, it's going to be 8 minutes. And you're going to play a lot of ads. Bye.